A husband and wife from Minnesota are the only Americans unaccounted for in that disaster. Their children say their parents were not among those passengers whose bodies were recently recovered. A vigil for the couple was held tonight. Now, Seattle is known for its rainy days, but it seldom gets snow like this. The town is practically closed down because of a massive snowstorm. KKL 9's Edward Lawrence has more on the story. It's a battle between tech companies and the entertainment industry. If you use the online encyclopedia, uh, Wikipedia, you might get caught in, right in the middle. The website has gone dark in the U.S. at least for one day. A murder suspect who claimed to be a member of the famous Rockefeller family was in court today. KCAL Live's Randy Page tells us that person who found the bones of the murder victim was first to take the stand in the preliminary hearing. Two malnourished sea lion pups that came into the San Pedro's Marine Mammal Care Center last November were fixed up, battened up, and released back to the ocean today in Rancho's Palos Verdes. Good luck. Yeah, good luck. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> A Dorito-loving dog stole the show in one million. For frequent flyers, just like the express check out of the grocery store, several airports are testing express lanes for passengers who agree to be pre-checked before boarding. KCAL 9's Amy Johnson explains how this program works. You have to get to the restroom, forget about it. You'll have to squeeze through. Yeah. No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> I'm sure that's not a problem. It's open up, yeah. <laughs> anyway, so I had it, to get that out. We've been talking about rain this weekend, and yes. I'm wondering if it's going to be uh, heavier yeah. than we first thought in the uh, earlier part of the week, Josh. Later tonight on KCAL 9, the real story of the Tuskegee Airmen and a pair of lethal ladies take down the underworld. KCAL 9's Kevin Frazier has a preview. Conned by a five-year-old girl, police in Glendora say two thieves used the little girl to talk their way into a woman's home, and then they cleaned it out. KCAL 9's Juan Fernandez is live in Glendora with details on the scam and reaction from the victim tonight. Hi, Juan.